This feature allows you to search for and find a certain recording and allows you to view the recorded video material. First, let's look at search. Set up an RTSP connection for replay. Get the RTSP session ID with the help of the random number specified in the URL. This number is used to request the recorded video stream via RTSP with the command as shown. The session ID is, for example, 329-980-3267. Start the search with the command as shown. Set the start time in seconds from midnight on the 1st of January 2000 and set the end time in the same way. In the code shown, the start time is set to the 1st of January 2000 at zero hours and the end time is set to the 1st of April 2013 also at zero hours. The reply contains all slices up to the maximum entry number specified in the search command. One slice comprises 16 bytes. The first 32 bits represent the start time and the second 32 bits the stop time of the slice. The remainder contains slice specific flags and the file ID. Now let's look at replay. Set up an RTSP connection for replay. Get the RTSP session ID with the help of the random number specified in the URL. This number is used to request the recorded video stream via RTSP with the command as shown. The return session ID is for example 329-980-3267. Stop or pause the HD replay at the current position. Look for the time you're interested in in seconds since the 1st of January 2000 at zero hours using the command as shown. In the example we're looking for the segment that was previously returned during the search request. Dates are set as shown. Then start the playback of the recorded video stream with normal speed using the command as shown. Next, set the replay speed. To replay forwards, enter a value higher than zero, and to replay backwards, a value of less than zero. To stop or pause, enter the value zero. As a result, you can now search in the video and replay.